Oh, it's it it's the main idea because it's located in the beginning, right? Isn't it? Stupid people are never asked to do a lot. Ya, yeah. kemudian dijelaskan apa saja uh, alasannya kenapa uh, orang orang bodoh itu tidak akan disuruh macam-macam alasannya apa alasannya itu di kalimat kedua dan kalimat ketiga jadi so the the answer is ya yeah, two and three are are right ya yeah, jadi waktu kita lihat ini optionnya kita harus cek lagi di kalimat di mana letaknya ya yeah. oke okay. do you have any question so far Mbak Kristina baru baru saya lihat nih sudah datang. Siapa lagi yang baru datang? Mbak Alfi, Mbak Isnain, Mbak Istiqomah. Iya, Mbak Kusmiati, Mbak Kristina, Mbak Martija. Mbak Nasi Orta, Oktari ada dua aku nih di sini. Mbak Rahmawati. Mbak Rianti, oke. Okay. Everyone, all uh, is is come is coming. Okay, and then paragraph three. I read it for you. Free time is a great for brainstorming. Admittedly, admittedly, this seems to be a bad choice of words. Yet the ideas stupid people create tend to be original. For example, when it was the last time someone stupid said something, and met one one thing about it. It seems that people are always talking about someone else, else's dumb idea. An example of such an idea would be how many stories will that English teacher drop before having struck? He, this would suggest that stupid people may have the, the upper hand when it comes to thinking up original ideas. In fact, the next time someone wants an original idea for something, they should try talking to their local community stupid person. The reason for this is that while a stupid person thinks with his head, he does he does not do so in an organized manner. This is why they have so much creativity. By thinking in this fashion, their ideas have a natural tendency to flow more easily, without the interruptions which occur from the editing of talks that logical people would have no normally. Thus, if someone else should say to, to one, that was a stupid idea, one should merely look that person straight in the, the, in the eye and say thank you. This also means that the claim stupid minds think alike is not, is not true. All stupid minds have different ideas, each idea being original. How do you think about this? Ini kayak apa ya? Kayak kalimat sindiran bahwa orang-orang bodoh itu bukan sepenuhnya nggak bisa melakukan apa-apa tapi ada keuntungannya menjadi orang bodoh ya yeah. that's right is that right di sini diceritakan bahwa orang bodoh punya original idea karena idenya berbeda dengan ide orang lain yang dianggap orang pasti bodoh karena berbeda ya yeah. tidak selamanya pemik uh, Opini kita harus sama dengan orang lain. Benar gak? Ya. Iya. Dari situ munculnya. Benar gak? Berarti unik ya. Unik. Ada tanda-tanda inovasi gitu. Menciptakan sesuatu yang baru. Beda dari yang lain. Kreatif. That's right. Iya. That's right. Jadi. Iya. Jangan, ya dari bacaan ini saya juga sekalian refleksi ya, bahwa ya tidak selamanya orang bodoh itu ya betul-betul di bawah, tapi jangan langsung diremehkan gitu. Iya, kreatif. Kreatif mendatangkan sesuatu yang baru. That's right. Yang original ya. Iya. Yeah. Yes, that's right. I agree with you. So, the supporting ideas of the paragraph are 
One, stupid people have so much creativity. Two, all stupid minds have different ideas. Three, the ideas stupid people create tend to be original. Wow, so how number one? One and two. One and two. Stupid people have so much creativity and all stupid. Uh, 